The following program is presented by Chick-fil-A South Florida and Bright Star Credit Union. Spanish River High takes on the Benjamin School tonight on School Duel. And welcome to School Duel, where 24 South Florida high schools battle it out. And tonight's game features Spanish River High versus the Benjamin School in what should be quite a showdown. Before we begin, let me tell you what these students are playing for. Well, first off, both teams will win beautiful trophies courtesy of our sponsor, Edco Awards and Specialties. Thank you, Edco. For the runner-up school tonight, each player receives $50 from our sponsor, Bright Star Credit Union. Thank you, Bright Star. <laughs> and last but not least, for the winners, well, each of these students will walk away with free chicken sandwiches for an entire year, courtesy of Chick-fil-A South Florida. Thank you, Chick-fil-A South Florida. Let's get started. Our opening round is called First Strike. And in this round, it's school versus school. Each question is worth 10 points, and any question answered incorrectly gives the other school a chance to steal. All right, schools, hands on the buzzers and prepare for the first strike. <laughs> Beverages. It is prepared using leaves from a shrub native to China and is the most widely consumed beverage in the world. Fernando? Tea. Yes, very good. We are off. Next question. Mythological creatures. It had the head of a human, the body of a lion, and the wings of a bird. Identify, Chester. Chimera. Incorrect. Spanish River, Fernando. Griffin. Incorrect. It's the Sphinx. All right, let's move on to grammar. What is the grammatical term for the kind of modifier that can be indefinite, like a and an, or definite, like the? Chester. Article. Very good. All right. Titles. What title referred to the rulers of ancient Carthage after their last king and the rulers of ancient Israel before their first king? Today, it refers to a government official who presides over a courtroom. Chester. Judge. Yes, very good. Spelling. Meaning new, creative, or different. Spell the word innovative. Chester. I-N-N-O-V-A-T-I-V-E. -N -N -V -V -E. Innovative. All right, good job. All right, the cell. What organelle found in animal cells is a specific type of vesicle that is involved in repairing the cell membrane and, most famously, breaking down and disposing of waste? Tyler. Lysosome. Very good. All right, it's time for the What Am I question brought to you by the Femme Foundation. Our contestants here are given a clue about something or someone and will be shown a picture that will slowly reveal itself. So here goes. An early type of it was called a penny farthing and had one large wheel and one small wheel. Identify Tyler. Bicycle. Yes, that's exactly what we're talking about. And the basic design of the bicycle has remained essentially unchanged since the first chain-driven bikes were developed around 1885. All right, our next question deals with composers. Franz Liszt was born in what is now Hungary when it was ruled by this country. Name this European nation whose native composers include Haydn and Mozart. Fernando. Austria. Very good. <laughs> U.S. history. What two-word phrase was used in the mid-1800s to refer to the idea that the U.S. was ordained to stretch from the Atlantic? Yes, Chester? Manifest destiny. Yes, very good. All right, a question about streets. Name the New York City street famous for its musical theater venues, Chester. Broadway. Yes, very good. Poetry. Its narrator laments a love lost named Lenore, while its title character sits on a bust above the chamber door. Identify this poem by Edgar Allan Poe about a nighttime visit by a mysterious Fernando. The Raven. Yes, very good. Oh, there's 
the horn, and that means the end of the first strike round. We do have the Benjamin School leading. They have 70 points. Spanish River has 30 points, but don't go anywhere. We'll be right back with more School Duel after these messages. <laughs> My name is Joseph, and a little thing I love about Chick-fil-A nuggets is they're so good. Every single time, you bite into that nugget, and it's just so crispy, but somehow juicy. That perfect balance. And then if you just grab a couple sauces, you're going to be in heaven. Hey, I'm Chambry, and a little thing I love about Chick-fil-A's mac and cheese is how rich and cheesy it is. I just scoop the crispy top, and it's so good. It's so homey. It's like, wow, thank you. I needed that. Hey, I'm Chambray, and a little thing I love about Chick-fil-A's mac and cheese is how rich and cheesy it is. I just scoop the crispy top, and it's so good. It's so homey. It's like, wow, thank you. I needed that. Beacon TV would like to thank the following sponsors for making School Duel possible. The first round of action ended with the Benjamin School leading. They have 70 points. Spanish River has 30 points. Now, before we begin the second round, let's take a minute to meet this week's competitors from each school. Hi, I'm Fernando. I'm a senior, team captain. Go Sharks. Hi, I'm Ali. I'm a senior. Go Sharks. Hi, I'm Tadius. I'm a senior. Go Sharks. Hi, I'm Caitlin. I'm a senior. I'm the team alternate. Go Sharks! What do you feel are your best subjects? Uh, I like math. You love math? I like math. Nothing I like, else? I like science too. I'm also good at science and math. What do you feel are your best subjects? Science and math. Wow, oh, just like teachers! Sharks on three, sharks on three. One, two, three, sharks! Hi, I'm Tyler. I'm a senior and captain of the Benjamin team. Let's go Bucks! My name's Chester. I'm a junior. Go Bucks! I'm Matias. I'm a senior. Go Bucks! We're doing good? Doing ready? Yeah. Ready, ready to go. Ready to rock. Tell us about your breakfast today. I had a glazed donut from Dunkin' Donuts. Ready to go. Breakfast <laughs> champions? Yeah, breakfast the champions. You ready, Matias? Good to go. Good to go. Bucks on three, bucks on three. One, two, three, bucks. All right, I love it. Big round of applause for both schools. And now that we know everyone, let's move on to round two, the Joust, which is presented by Public Supermarkets. Here, a player from each school competes head-to-head -head with a toss-up question. The winner gets three bonus questions for their school, and all questions are worth 10 points. All right, schools, it is time to Joust. Our first players competing are Fernando and Tyler. Come on down. Here's your toss-up question worth 10 points. What U.S. state's official nickname is the Ocean State because it has so many beaches and seaside towns, though despite its name, it is not actually an island? Yes, Fernando? Rhode Island. Yes, very good. All right, we're with Spanish River. Now, the following bonus questions all deal with official state 
nicknames. Bonus question number one. Nickname the Aloha State. What is the only U.S. state made up entirely of islands? Fernando? Hawaii. Yes, excellent. Bonus question number two. What state's official nickname is the Lone Star State? Yes, Fernando? Texas. Yes. Bonus question number three. What state is nicknamed the Old Dominion because of its home, Jamestown, the site of the first, Fernando? Virginia. Yes, very good. All right, our next two, Allie, Chester, come on down. It is your turn to joust. Here is your toss-up question worth 10 points. A Sky News article titled 12 Most Popular Selfies Ever included a famous selfie taken by Kylie Jenner at the annual gala at what New York City art museum? Yes, Chester. The Metropolitan Museum of Art. Yes, very good. We're now with the Benjamin School. The following bonus questions all deal with other famous selfies from the same article. Bonus question number one. Taken at a basketball game, one famous selfie features Blue Ivy Carter with what multi-platinum recording artist, her mother? That would be Beyonce Knowles Carter. Bonus question number two. A Japanese astronaut posted a selfie taken while on a spacewalk outside of what structure, which has been in low Earth, yes, Chester? The International Space Station. Yes, very good. Bonus question number three, nicknamed The Boss, what singer was captured in a fan selfie and is known for songs like Born to Run? Yes, Chester? Bruce Springsteen. Very good. All right, our last two to douse. Tejas and Mateus, come on down. Here's your toss-up question worth 10 points. How many days are there in a fortnight, a unit of time equivalent to two weeks? Yes, Mateus? 14 days. Very good. We're back with the Benjamin School. And the following bonus questions all deal with units of time. How many seconds are in two minutes? Tyler? 120. Very good. Bonus question number two. How many days are in a leap year? Chester? 366. Very good. Bonus question number three. In medieval Venice, how many days long was a quarantine, the period of time that sailors would have to remain isolated? Mateus? 14 days. Incorrect, it's 40 days. All right, that buzzer means the end to the joust. We do have the Benjamin School holding on to their lead. They now have 130 points. Spanish River has 70 points. Don't go anywhere. We will be right back with more School Duel after these messages. It must be fate that his cap and gown are the same color he wore for his kindergarten graduation. It's the same rascally smile, that hasn't changed. But he stands there, so sure, so ready to take on the world. He has arrived. It's hard not to resist and push against the door that's closing, but you give in a little, because the future is wide open. From each little moment to every major milestone, Publix, proud supporter of education. Lights. Camera. Action. I don't know. I've always just heard that. Now we're safe. Ah! But make sure you don't run out of power. Noted. Hello and welcome to Broward Teen News, Cypress Bay High School Edition, West Broward Edition, Marjorie Stillman Douglas High Edition. We're at Cooper City High School. And Broward Teen News starts now. BTN is South Florida's only teen-produced news program, produced by a different Broward High School every month. 
Broward Teen News, South Florida's student-produced news show by teens for teens. Beacon TV would like to thank the following sponsors for making School Duel possible. Local high schools match wits. Today's game has Spanish River High competing against the Benjamin School. Currently, the Benjamin School is leading their points 130, Spanish River 70 points. It is now time for the rapid action round, and during this round, each school receives an identical category of questions to answer quickly by themselves. Now, since Spanish River is trailing, they get to go first while the Benjamin School waits outside the studio for their turn with the same questions. Now today's category is starts with A as in alpha. In this category, the answer contains a word that starts with the letter A as in alpha. Each question is worth 10 points and remember you must answer these quickly or the judge will move you on. So here comes rapid action. Hands on the buzzer, cue music and let's begin. Virtual assistant developed by Amazon. Fernando. Alexa. Spanish word for water. Fernando. Agua. Purple gem that is a February birth. Yes, Fernando? Amethyst. An agreement or a mid sized sedan made by Honda. Fernando. Accord. Complete the Hollywood phrase. Lights, camera. Fernando. Action. Navy rank equivalent to a general in the Army. Name for the powers that fought the Allies in World War. Fernando. Axis. SI unit of electric current. The fifth book of the New Testament. Fernando. Epistle. Greek god of war called Mars by the Romans. Ali. Apollo. All right, good job. We got through all of your questions. Big round of applause for Spanish River High. And now with a little TV magic, let's bring in the Benjamin School. Welcome back to Benjamin School. Now it's your turn with the same questions. Today's category is starts with A as in alpha. And in this category, the answer contains a word that starts with the letter A as in alpha. Each question is worth 10 points. And remember, you must answer these quickly or the judge will move you on. So let's cue music and begin. Virtual assistant developed by Amazon. Tyler. Alexa. Spanish word for water. Mateus. Agua. Purple gem that is a February birthstone. Tyler. Aquamarine. An agreement or a mid-sized sedan made by Honda. Mateus. Acura. Complete the Hollywood phrase. Lights, camera. Tyler. Action. Navy rank equivalent to a general in the army. Tyler. Admiral. Name for the powers that fought the allies in World Chester. Access. SI unit of electric current. Tyler. Amp. The fifth book of the New Testament. Greek god of war called Mars. Tyler? Aries. All right, very good. We got through both questions. There's only one question that both teams missed, and that's the fifth book of the New Testament is Acts. All right, that ends the rapid action round. We do have the Benjamin School still leading. They now have 200 points, but Spanish River now has 130 points. Let's go ahead and take a short break, and then we'll be back for the final showdown to see which school wins this school duel game. Hey, I'm Chambray, and a little thing I love about Chick-fil-A's mac and cheese is how rich and cheesy it is. I just scoop the crispy top, and it's so good. It's so homey. It's like, wow, thank you. I needed that. Hey, my name is Joseph, and a little thing I love about Chick-fil-A nuggets is they're so good. Every single time you bite into that nugget, and it's just so crispy, but somehow juicy, that perfect balance. And then if you just grab a couple sauces, you're going to be in heaven. 
Hey, I'm Chambray, and a little thing I love about Chick-fil-A's mac and cheese is how rich and cheesy it is. I just scoop the crispy top, and it's so good. It's so homey. It's like, wow, thank you. I needed that. Beacon TV would like to thank the following sponsors for making School Duel possible. We've got a good game going as the Benjamin School is holding on to their lead over Spanish River. Current score, 200 to 130. All right, it's now time for the final showdown, and this is our last round. Our schools will go against each other again with toss-up questions, but this time the questions are worth 20 points each. Now, just a reminder, if a question is answered incorrectly, the other school can steal. And this is for the win. It is time for the final showdown. First question deals with... Literary characters. What is the name of the young wizard and main character in J.K. Rowling's seven volume? Yes, Tyler? Harry Potter. Bodies of water. The Tigris and Euphrates rivers eventually merge and end at what gulf, which gets, yes, Fernando? The Persian Gulf. Conflicts. When it was being fought, it was called the Great War or, yes, Mateus? The First World War. Machines. What simple machine consists of a nail with an inclined plane called a thread wrapped around it? Yes, Fernando. A pulley? Incorrect. The Benjamin School Chester. A screw. Sports. What sports rules include penalties for illegal formation, holding, delay of game, Chester? Football. Punctuation. What punctuation mark ends interrogative sentences like this one? Chester. Question mark. Movement math. If you are driving on a highway at an average speed of 65 miles per hour, how far will you drive in three hours? Tejas. Um. Oh. Uh, 215. Incorrect. Chester. 195. Religion. In Christian theology, the Trinity consists of the Father, Chester. Holy Spirit. TV. What nonprofit television network is known for the show's Frontline and This Old House? An educational Chester? PBS. Art. Examples of what three dimensional art form include Jeff Koons' Balloon Dog, Daniel Custer French's Standing Ch Tyler? Sculpture. Elements. This element is sometimes placed above fluorine instead of above lithium on the periodic table. Identify this lightest element with atomic number one. Mateus? Hydrogen. The Internet. Owned by Amazon, what website has aired episodes of Impact Wrestling and is the most popular place to live stream video games? Fernando. Twitch. U.S. History. How many stars were on the American flag that Betsy Ross sewed? Chester. 13. Tough Capitals. Founded by the Spanish conquistador Diego de Lozada, what city is now the capital of Venezuela? Fernando. Caracas. Streaming Services. What streaming service features the programs The Mandalorian? Look, yes, Tyler? Disney Plus. Companies. What third largest pizza delivery chain is named for its founder, whose surname is... Sh sh yes, Tyler? Papa John's. Math. What does the T stand for in the mathematical mnemonic device Sokatoa? Mateus? Tangent. Aircraft. Though it often refers to a particular modified Boeing 747, what three-word term, Chester? Force One. Islands. What island nation located in the Indian Ocean was known as Ceylon until Fernando? Sri Lanka. Languages. What fourth letter of the Greek alphabet is shaped like a Fernando? Delta. Novels. Although Ghost Set a Watchman was marked as its sequel, it was really a very early draft of what novel by Harper Lee? Tyler. To Kill a Mockingbird. Musicals. What biographical musical includes the song The Election of 1800? Chester. Hamilton. Oh, that
that sign brings an end to this school duel game. As the Benjamin School pulls away, they held on to their lead, going on to beating Spanish River. Our ending score, 540 points to 230 points. Congratulations, the Benjamin School. You each have won Chick-fil-A chicken sandwiches for an entire year, courtesy of Chick-fil-A South Florida. Big round of applause for them. And of course, great job to everyone. So let's hear it for both schools. At this time, we want to thank all of our sponsors for making School Duel possible. And of course, you at home for watching. Don't forget to check out our website at schoolduel.tv where you can find out more about the schools involved. You can also watch past shows. And please remember to use hashtag School Duel to contact us through social media. But most importantly, make sure that you tune in next week to School Duel Thursday at 8 p.m. as Coral Glades High takes on Cooper City High in what should be another great game. Goodbye, everyone, and thanks for joining. <laughs>